Hi, I'm a Trails and Open Space Forest Gnome and you're watching Snapshot 6. In this video, we'll take a look at some of the efforts of the Unified Government over the month of April, including the new Leisure Services activity, Bring the Gnome Home. If you find me out in the forest, return me to the Sandy Creek Nature Center and receive a cool prize from a great local business. In March, the Leisure Services Department started a new activity for Athens residents. Bring the Gnome Home is a fun, interactive program designed as a way to encourage residents to get outside and experience local trails. ACC Gov Trails and Open Space staff hides a friendly forest gnome somewhere along athens Clark County's 43 plus miles of trails. The first person to find the gnome and return him to his home at Sandy Creek Nature Center receives a prize generously provided by a local business sponsor. Although the gnome has stayed home recently due to COVID-19 concerns, he'll be found on the trails again beginning August 1st. The gnome is hidden in a new spot each month, so keep your eyes peeled and check out different trails. Need a hint or inspiration for more trails to visit? Follow ACC Trails on Facebook or visit accgov.com slash trails and start exploring. In March, the Public Information Office updated its broadcasting equipment to begin streaming Mayor and Commission meetings live through the Facebook Live platform on the main ACC Gov page. After adding this new platform, Mayor and Commission meetings now broadcast live on ACTV cable channel 180 and also stream live and on demand on YouTube, the ACC Gov website, and Facebook. The online stream for these meetings is high definition quality. This allows for cable cutting viewers to also watch live at home through the YouTube or Facebook app on set top boxes such as Roku or Apple TV in HD quality. Search for ACC GOV in apps or online to find the ACC Gov videos. On March 5th, the 45th juried exhibition opened at the Linden House Art Center with 600 people in attendance. The 45th show includes 144 artists from around the community and 199 works of art selected by Larry Osai Mensa. Due to the COVID-19 pandemic, and closure of ACC Gov facilities, this exhibition was only on view for eight days before moving to an online exhibition. These posts included images of the works in the show, images of the artist, and a brief story by each artist reflecting on their inspiration and what they loved about Athens. In March, members of the ACC Gov Fire Department participated in a 32-hour confined space technical rescue class. This class is designed to build upon skills that the participants had already acquired through previous training and practical use. The course is geared toward helping rescue technicians learn knowledge and skills to perform rescues in confined spaces. Due to the danger involved, rescuers practice their skills as a coordinated team under the guidance of several highly trained instructors. The culmination of their four-day training was a simulated rescue scenario of several patients trapped inside confined spaces. All participants had to work together as one unit and ultimately were able to effectively handle all those situations in the scenario. The Sustainability Office and Leisure Services Department staff teamed up to conduct the annual controlled burn of the native Piedmont Prairie space at Sandy Creek Nature Center in March. The burn on the three-quarter acre site took two hours from start to finish with an actual burn time of only 30 minutes. Burning the prairie every year is an essential function for habitat health that releases vital nutrients, promotes competition between native species, and helps control woody and invasive plants that would otherwise quickly degrade this once common habitat. The burn used standards under development by USDA Forest Service related to wildland firefighting and physical distancing to protect worker safety. This is the 15th year of a controlled burn of the prairie. In response to the COVID-19 pandemic, the Public Information Office began producing regular video addresses 
as of March 17th with updates from Mayor Kelly Gertz. In these videos, Mayor Gertz highlighted new information about the virus and local government response efforts, told stories about community efforts, discussed the best ways for residents to stay safe, and provided encouragement to Athens residents during changing local and state requirements. The videos are produced on a one to two week basis and distributed through accgov.com, Facebook, YouTube, Instagram's IGTV platform, and ACTV Cable Channel 180. Thank you for watching Snapshot 6. See you again next month.